everyone, I'm back. Okay, so <clears throat> I have um, Hobby Lobby here, and there's a little story behind this. <laughs> okay, so last Thursday, I called to see if they could hold these, and I asked how many they had. She said, well, we have two, and I said, okay, can you hold them both? So <clears throat> now the thing was is that I didn't get to go after all. Um, something came up. I didn't get to go, and so I made it there Friday. When I went there, I asked if I could have the holes that, that were there from the day before. She says, oh, we don't have them here anymore. Um, anything that's not picked up by the end of the day, you know, um, we put them back. And I said, oh, well, can you just check just in case, you know, because um, something it, sometimes it has happened. I will be honest with you. Sometimes I'll have something on hold, and sometimes I just don't make it, but I go back the next day, you know, the day after or whatever, and they're still sitting there. So um, she says, no, they're, they're not here. They're, they're not here. They're just not here because everything gets sent back. Yada, yada. So I went to the back. I look uh, aisle per aisle with the paper, the stamps, the machines, um, you know, where they have the machines, the, the die cuts, the, I mean, stamps, um, stickers, every aisle in the craft, you know, craft section, like, like the scrapbooking, you know, what we do, the paper stuff and all that good stuff. There was nothing. I went to clearance and I thought, well, maybe because the girl did mention that one of them was broken. She said, one of them is broken. I said, well, is it really bad? And she goes, well, it's kind of broken, like, more from one side, whatever. And I said, well, if it's still intact, I said, um, at, you know, maybe your manager will let me have it at a at a better discount. And she asked, he said, she, she came back and said that he would let me have it at 50% off. And I said, you know what, okay, that's fine. Um, so I said, can you just hold them, you know, just hold them both. So she did, and she put, you know, of course, she put my name or whatever. And so... With that said, I, I checked that day and I couldn't find them. But I um I ended up buying these two because I thought, well, I'm gonna need refills. So I paid for one and my husband paid for the other because we needed to use coupons. And you know how Hobby Lobby is. You need to use one per family per day or per person. Um so I thought, okay, so um my husband and I can get one. We use the same coupon, blah blah. So I did that. So then, um, that was, um, that was Friday because Thursday I couldn't make it, right? So Friday when I went, you know, I only found these there and I was like kicking myself because I didn't make it that day, but I just couldn't. Something just really came up and I couldn't make it. And, um, so I ended up with these only and I thought, well, I'm going to find them somewhere. So, you know, so I decided, my husband went to go wash my car early Saturday morning and, um, and I was, you know, just detailing the inside because he only went to go wash it and vacuum it. So I was doing the detailing inside. And I was about done when I just, it was going to be 3 o'clock and I decided to call Hobby Lobby again. And the same girl that put him on hold for me answered the phone. And I said, excuse me. I said, but I think I remember you. I said, um, you put a couple of items for me on hold. She goes, yeah, those little containers. I said, yes, yes. And I said, well, um... Do you know if you still have them? I said, because I went there yesterday, and the lady that um, that helped me told me that they were already put back, but when I went to the back, there was nothing to be found. I said, but can you double check for me and see if maybe y'all have them? And she didn't tell me exactly where she found them, but um, she went to go check, or she checked wherever, maybe by the registers or in the back, but she came back and she says, I found them, and I said, so you do have them? She says, yes, we have them. And I was like, oh, my God, you know, I wanted to just be right there to slap that lady. I seriously, I mean, I mean it. Um, so, so then I, um, I said, well, you know what? I said, are they the same ones? She goes, yeah, they're the same ones. And I said, okay, can you put those on hold? I will be over there within the hour. I said, um, I just got to, you know, get ready. And, of course, I got to take a shower because I'm outside and um changing everything and then i hit it that way so my i told my husband my husband says well then let's go let's get out of here you know and and he doesn't like to be stuck at home so on weekends he's like let's get out of here so we went and <clears throat> and um and i thought oh gosh you know what i forgot to to ask hubby for one of the girls to come down with me because i went ahead and just stayed in the car so just so i can get out and get these and i was like darn and so 
I I got off and I went to the registers and the same lady that helped me, I don't know who she was, if she was the manager herself or if she was one of the assistants or whatnot, what she um I said, um, I'm here for the bins that I was looking for on Thursday. I said, and I called today, and they told me that, you know, they went ahead and put them on hold for me again. I said, but I never found them in the back. I said, but all of a sudden, they just reappeared, and they're up here in the front somewhere. I told her like that, and she, she just looked at me like, whatever, like, you know, and <laughs> so she gives them to me. And I take them to the register. And as I'm inspecting them a little bit, I notice that not only one, but this is not the bad one. This is the, you know, one of the ones that wasn't supposed to be broken. This is the one that's supposed to be broken the most. As you can see, when I open it, let me move this one, sorry. When I open it, you see? But it's still intact over here on this side. So I'm okay with that. Because it's not like I'm going to be carrying it around everywhere I go. You know what I mean? Maybe there'll be, maybe it'll be, um, I don't know. Maybe I can save it from right there or something. I don't know what I could do. But if y'all have any ideas what can be used. Just so that it can be, you know, stay intact and still swing open. Now, the, the, what, so, so I paid. I paid, um, the 50% off on one and then I paid 40% off on the other right because I'm using a coupon on one and the other one's already discounted so this is discounted and I'm using a coupon on this one okay well something told me you better check so when I was done I stopped by the doors where they have their carts and I noticed that this one was open okay so I was like uh oh it's open so I wanted to make sure that all three sheets were in here you know Ah, I'm using one hand, sorry guys, because my other hand's over the uh, tripod. And they, they were there, okay, they were there. And then, when I came to open this one, I noticed that it did have the lock, and, you know, the little lockanism or whatever. Um, this little deal. So I thought, okay, the sheets are in there, all three should be in there. But, that's when I noticed the crack on this one as well. And I thought, well, I'm not paying full price for something that's broken. I know that I'm still getting it at 40% off, but, you know, it's still not considered in 100%, um, you know, good condition. So, I, I um, put them back in the bag. I went to that same nasty lady, and I told her, okay, so I noticed that the other one is also broken. I said, can you do something about that? And she's like, um, yeah, we'll go ahead and do the same thing for 50% off. I was like, okay. So she told the lady at the register, and I had to stand right back in line again. And um, so I did, and I ended up getting 50% off on each one. So um, so that was the story for the day of that day. <laughs> so now this is my idea now that I decided. I've been wanting to do this idea, but I always ended up making my own storage, um, my own storage um, binders for my dies. But this time I thought, you know what, I want to go this way. I'm going to see how these work. And if they don't work for me, then I'm just going to get rid of it. I'll just, you know, sell them. But uh, I'm going to give, give it a try. Hopefully they are sturdy enough and they're not that flimsy where your dies are beginning to kind of, you know, these sheets bend and the dies come apart and all that. But so far the videos that I've seen that people share their projects, they share the, these sheets here. And they show that their dies are all intact even though they pick it up, they lift it from their bin. And they flip it over or whatnot, and they still stay intact. So I'm hoping that will work. And as I mentioned on my very first video coming back from MIA, <laughs> um, I did show my Dollar Tree um, project that uh, the, the die storage that I had planned on, on going with, but I decided not to, and I changed my mind, and I want to go with this route, uh, with this storage. That is... Um, that is... Um, up for grabs you know for those of you that are interested in that one and like I had said it was uh, going to be um, I think it was gonna be like six plus shipping so let me know guys all right that is it that's all my hauls and I just need to come back with my Aliexpress and my um, a couple of little you know um, projects that I've made and um, 
and that's it so mm, all right guys <laughs> we'll talk to y'all soon um and uh thank you so much for stopping by leave your comments down below give me a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe if you're not a subscriber yet all right and for all of those that are new to my channel and have subscribed um thank you so much for supporting me and subscribing to my channel and stay tuned for more videos i will try to stay you know more um more active and um create a little more for you guys i know i create and stuff but it's just that sometimes i don't always you know create and and, and share i just give the creations you know as gifts and i don't get to show them so that is it all right love y'all see y'all soon